Now, when YouTube made these, this new design, it's more complex. It takes three steps to see the comments made in my channel for my profile, which means that it's not a convenient channel design. Along with that, when I go and check my subscriptions, I have the ability to see the comments that the guys I subscribe to make. And I don't like having that power over people. The power to see what they said to someone in the, a video that it has, that's maybe not my business at all. I think that'll make people a lot more cautious about what they say. I mean, when you go to my profile from before, you could have seen some of the comments I made. I would be okay with that. Because it's from my profile that you're getting from this from. But now, it's a little bit more convoluted. I know that's a cliche word I use a lot, but it applies here perfectly. I mean, this might be good if you want you want to conglomerate likes and favorites and subscriptions to a video or a channel of that video. But other than that, it's a little creepy unless you're me and you intend to say weird shit from time to time. And even then, I'm relatively tamed compared to most other YouTubers. My Justin TV is really untamed at times. But that's all I gotta say. Yeah.